We're in Backup Exec 2014. I'm going to show you how to create a synthetic backup. A synthetic backup will take uh, a full backup and any incremental or differential backups that you have and create one new backup out of that. So if we go ahead and create, uh, click on the Backup and Restore button, click a One Time Backup, and then make sure that you have the backup server selected that you're going to want to choose here. So let's go ahead and click Backup. Uh, backup to disk, uh, create a synthetic backup. Here we are. So go ahead and click on that. All right, so we've got, uh, it shows three different types of things here. It shows our full backup, our incremental backup, uh, and then it shows our synthetic backup. So let's go ahead and click on edit. And if we scroll down to our synthetic backup, it will uh, take place uh, every week on Saturday at 11 o'clock, of course, you can certainly change that to any other day that you want or multiple days uh, or hours, months, whatever it is that you would like. So what it'll do is it will take that information from the full and our incremental and it will create a new synthetic backup using all that information into a brand new one. And from here, of course, you can choose which uh, folders and files that you want to select. I'm just going to choose our C drive that is there, of course, by default. And then you may want to test your error credentials if that's not been done yet. And then when you're done, you can go ahead and click OK. And uh, you can get started on your synthetic back.